wonder what else is on here. As per your request, Lieutenant Gordon has tripled security at the debate. Thanks, Alfred. Hmm. That's what it is. It's a plan of the old Monarch Theater. The auditorium where the debate's being held. Hmm. I hacked into the image feeds from the security cameras at the auditorium. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. Hells, details about your father. They must have been quite upsetting. I can't imagine how you must feel. To learn so much in so little time. To be honest, Alfred, nothing can shock me anymore. Not when it comes to my parents. I wish I felt the same way. But I suppose no good can come from wallowing. The city needs you now more than ever. I'll, uh, leave you to it then. Okay. Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent appears to be hitting some potholes on his... Wait a minute. The images on these cameras haven't changed. Something's wrong. Penguin's men may have commandeered the cameras on their end. We could just be looking at... What they want us to see. Warn Gordon that he may have visitors. I have to get down there. Now. to you actually something's come up something that's well... harvey listen to me your life is in danger because of penguin and his thugs thanks but there is an army of security here they have me in some back room until the debate begins for my own protection they said a little bit of overkill if you ask me it's not overkill harvey it's a real please i need to get this off my chest uh look bruce I didn't want to do this over the phone, but my advisors are telling me that I need to... <clears throat> that I need to distance myself from you. <laughs> Until all this mess with your family blows over. There. <laughs> I, I don't care, Harvey. You need to get out of there. You can't leave now. I mean, think of the message that would send to the voters. Bruce, I'm ahead in the polls. A win tonight and I could take the election. What with the allegations in the press, and now this mess with Falcone, you're a liability. But here's the thing, Bruce. Without your money, I am dead in the water. I know this is a delicate topic, but I need you to keep me afloat. I may have to trash you in public, but you and me, we all know the truth about our friendship. Forget your campaign for a minute. The money won't matter if you're dead. Yeah, well, until I am, it is still my primary concern. Listen, I hate to push you, but I... I need to know. Can I count on your money, Bruce? Whatever it takes to save Gotham, that's what we wanted. Okay. I'll always support you, Harvey. Well, oh, thank you, Bruce. Thank you. You don't know how much this means to me. To Gotham. I'm sorry, Bruce. The makeup person is here. I guess she needs to put on my face. I hope you can still watch the debate somewhere. Uh, no matter what I have to say tonight, remember. You are always my friend. Harvey! quiet so far no. I've got a feeling that's about to change I'm glad I took a chance on this this collaboration of ours keep on doing what you're doing and the rest of Gotham will start to see you like I do 
a hero. I appreciate the sentiment, Jim. We have bigger things to worry about right now. Your security has been compromised. I've got patrols on every door. You better check on them. I'd keep that holstered if I were you. What's she doing here? She was part of that robbery at the mayor's office. Really? You're gonna drag out that dead horse? I think she's mending her ways. Oh, he's right, Lieutenant. I don't do the bad things anymore. Unless it's on request. Well, this better not come back to bite me. Alpha Patrol, come in. That, um, hmm. incident in the bar. Dead is its own kind of cage. I can't stand being in it. Not that I needed your help or anything, but you had my back. I thought I'd repay the favor. You know, like you scratch my back, I cut some people up. This is no bar fight. They're coming with everything they have. Good. That brawl barely had me break a sweat. None of my men on the ground are responding. Uh -huh. Enough uh -huh. waiting. We're going in. Alpha, do you read? Now aren't you glad I'm here? Well, you have a better shot than my SWAT team of getting in there quietly. We are seriously underfunded at the GCPD. Sounds like a vote for Dent, Lieutenant. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to our live debate for the next mayor of Gotham City. This is an important debate for these two candidates, incumbent Mayor Hamilton Hill and the challenger Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent. And it's also important for you, the citizens of Gotham, who will soon head to the polls to decide the future of your home, a city that's faced its share of hardships in recent years. We know why they weren't responding. Gordon, we found one of your patrols. They've been terminated. Oh, God damn so sorry, ladies and gents. As you might have guessed, there's been a change to tonight's program. First order of business. Firing the moderator! I hate to be a downer, but these hostages, I don't like their chances. If we're quick and decisive, no one else has to die. If you say so. But Penguin's playing for keeps. Fanatics always do. You know. You'll do. Get out of here. Keep it quiet back there. These guys are armed to the teeth. Uh, we need a new moderator. Come on, you. You there. Yes. No, thank you for volunteering. Please. No. Go on, then. Introduce the candidates. Stage fright, huh? All right. I'll get you started. But this is your show. Three hostiles. Gotta take them out quietly. Don't 
Terre. Maybe next time. Someone else do the dirty work. Go on, love. You know what to do. Subject 9, Esther Cobblepot. You've been declared criminally insane and committed to Arkham indefinitely oh, as a ward of the state. Please, I'll sell you the victim. Please don't do this. You had your chance. You should have made the deal we offered you. Give her the drug. Thomas, we will not offer you the drug. Thomas, we will not offer you the drug. You will want Esther. You know I always get what I want. Commence the procedure. Give her a dose she won't come back from. Now you know. Now you will see. Entrance. Go. Why don't you kick the crap out of here? 
Him. He didn't know when to stop. I had him killed because of it. Don't yeah. well bring back my poor old mum. So this is for her. He won't let you kill anyone else. Why your turn, Dent? Stop! I had him killed because of it! Don't want to bring back my poor old mum. So this is for her. Why don't you kill anyone else? Wait your turn, Dent! Your revolution is over, Penguin. On the contrary, we're just getting started! <laughs> after Mayor Hamilton Hill was confirmed dead. While several members of the Children of Arkham have been arrested, the Penguin is still at large. Meanwhile, the Wayne family scandal continued to escalate after the full list of Thomas Wayne's victims was released to the public. Mr. Wayne. Lieutenant. He's lucky. 
have been much worse if the Batman hadn't been there. But there still will be scars. ist die zweite Episode beendet. Vielen Dank fürs Zuschauen und ja, wir machen hier mal ganz kurz weiter, denn ich denke mal, wir kriegen noch eine kleine Vorschau auf die dritte Episode. Wie gesagt, vielen Dank fürs Zuschauen und bis zur nächsten Episode. Ja, macht was draus, habt einen schönen Tag. Tschüssi. Next time on Batman, the Telltale series. Batman saved me, but I know this isn't over. Who are these people, Bruce? Authorities are scrambling. The so-called children of Arkham have the city in a frenzy, but there's still no sign of their masked leader. With Hill and Falcone dead by their hands, the question on everyone's lips is, who's next? After that news about your father sending innocent people to Arkham, sounds like the whole city wants your head on a pike. The Waynes have always run this company, but now they want to decide what your future at this company will be. Do you really think Bruce Wayne is worth protecting? What do you want from me? No more hiding, but for anyone. But don't worry, Bruce Wayne's finally gonna get what's coming to him. Bruce!